Hey guys, welcome to an in-depth comparison between Samsung Galaxy S24 and Xiaomi 14. These two devices are the most powerful and compact Android devices that are available in India as of today. In this video, let us see how these two devices fare against each other or are there any alternate devices that you can go rather than investing more than 60k or $800 on these two devices. Let's sit back, relax and watch the video till the end. And guys, more than 90% of my viewers are not yet subscribed to my channel. Please do subscribe, like, share, comment and watch the video till the end. Having one of the top of the line processors, both device does not break a sweat when performing day to day activity or even performing multiple tasks. On the front, we have a 6.2 inch dynamic LTPO AMOLED 2x 120Hz display on Galaxy S24 and we have a 6.36 inch LTPO OLED 120Hz display Xiaomi 14. Galaxy S24's display have a peak brightness of 2600 nits whereas Xiaomi can go up to 3000 nits of peak brightness. We also have a 12 megapixel autofocus trend facing camera and a speaker geek cutout on top of S24. And we have a 32 megapixel front facing camera and a tiny speaker grill on Xiaomi 14. On the bottom of the device, we have speaker gear cutouts and USB 3.2 Type C port, primary microphones, as well as dual SIM tray, and both devices support eSIM option also. On the right hand side, we have a power button and a volume rocker key, which have a great tactile feedback on both the devices. We have antenna bands on the left hand side of the devices and on the top of the device we have a dual secondary microphone on S24. Both devices have aluminum frame whereas Samsung claims its armor aluminum 2 frame is much stronger and scratch resistant. Glass on the both front and back of the S24 is protected by Corning's Gorilla Glass Victus 2 whereas Xiaomi 14 have a Corning Gorilla Glass Victus protection. We have a 50 megapixel main camera with OIS and a 10 megapixel 3x optical zoom lens and a 12 megapixel ultra wide lens on the Galaxy S24. Whereas we have a 50 megapixel main lens with OIS, a 50 megapixel 3.2x optical zoom lens and a 50 megapixel ultra wide lens Xiaomi 14. Here are some of the key feature and technical specification of Xiaomi 14. And here are some of the technical specification and key features of Samsung Galaxy S24. The Xiaomi 14 have an optical in-display fingerprint sensor whereas the Galaxy S24 have an ultrasonic in-display fingerprint sensor which is perfectly placed and easily accessible compared to Xiaomi 14. Unlike Samsung Galaxy S24, Xiaomi 14 comes with a 120W fast charger, a case and a pre-applied screen protector inside the box itself whereas you will only get a data cable inside the Samsung Galaxy S24 box. Xiaomi 14 have promised a 4 year of OS update and a 5 years of security patch update whereas Samsung this time around has promised a 7 year of OS and security patch update all its S24 lineups. You can expect a 4.5 to 5.5 hour of screen on time on Samsung Galaxy S24 whereas you can easily get a 6 hour of screen on time from Xiaomi 14. Galaxy S24 series comes with a ton of AI features and here are the list of those features which are useful in many ways. Let us do the speaker test of S24. Now let us check the speaker output of Xiaomi 14.
definitely Xiaomi 14 sounds richer and louder compared to S24. During our benchmark test, we have kept S24 on standard mode and Xiaomi 14 in the performance mode. Now let's clear all the background app and start Antutu benchmark test on both the device. From the result we can see that Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 processor is performing much better than the Exynos 2400 and both devices gain almost similar type of temperature during this test. Let us keep both the device aside for few minutes before starting our next test. Now let us run a 15 minutes long CPU throttling test on both the devices. Even though both devices throttled a lot, we can see from this result that Xiaomi 14 have a much better sustained performance compared to S24. Now let us run 3 d Mark Wildlife Extreme Stress Test Benchmark on both the devices. Ten minutes into the test, we got a overheating warning on Xiaomi 14 and the benchmark shuts down. This is not the first time that's happening on this device. We had the similar experience when we did the comparison between OnePlus 12 and Xiaomi 14 also. During this period, we have noticed the device was too hot to touch and this is the extreme temperature that I have felt on any device till date. At this point, we let the Xiaomi 14 to cool down and let the S24 to run the benchmark and complete it. These are the results that we got on S24 after running the wildlife extreme stress test. After giving enough rest for both the devices, we ran the Geekwin 6 benchmark CPU test. Even though the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 performs better than the Exynos 2400, in this particular test we got better result on S24 compared to Xiaomi 14. Now let's run the GPU test on Geekbench benchmark. Again the S24 outperforms Xiaomi 14 in this test. After the Geekbench we ran the network speed test on both the device connecting to the same Wi-Fi network and we got exactly similar results on both the devices.
and when it comes to camera both devices performs excellently both devices have its small flaws to know more about the camera performance of these two devices please do watch the complete camera review which i have done on S24 and Xiaomi 14 the link for the video is given in the description below both devices can give you excellent output however S24's image during the daytime have slightly better detail better color accuracy and better HDR performance Human images taken from S24 also have slightly better detail compared to Xiaomi 14 whether the images are taken from the front camera or from the rear cameras. From these images we can see that S24 is accurately representing the blue color of the flower whereas Xiaomi 14 almost made it white. Xiaomi 14's 3.2x optical zoom camera also functions as a telemacro lens which is absent on S24. Both devices have a ton of shooting mode and you can even take the images and videos using their pro modes which like during the daytime S24 images taken during the night also have slightly better detail and better skin representation compared to Xiaomi 14. However, when it comes to taking images during the night time, Xiaomi 14 represent better color, have slightly better detail and even controls the light source much better compared to S24. S24 during night time keeps the images on the cooler side compared to Xiaomi 14 which gives you warmer and more accurate colors. So there you have it guys, an in-depth review between Samsung Galaxy S24 and Xiaomi 14. Even though Xiaomi 14 performs excellently and even outperforms S24 in many scenarios, it's hard to recommend Xiaomi 14 over S24. One of the major concern is of the software update that we are going to get on Xiaomi 14. Second one being the horrible resale market value. Alternatively, you can even consider OnePlus 12 which is having a bigger and better display, a better battery life and a pretty good camera set. All for this video guys, see you all in my next video.